Holy crap, everybody! Oh my god, dude. I'm so excited. I haven't been this excited in a while. Breaking news in the King Cobra universe. Uh, probably is some of you guys don't know, but I'm going to go over it real quick, give you a brief history. But just to let you know, anybody who who is in the universe who does know about King Cobra, he's got a girlfriend, and it is horrifying. So I'm going to go over it. I, I really haven't been this excited in like months, you know? Been in a deep depression for maybe nine months. Then I see Cobes got a girlfriend. It's a great day. So I'm gonna give over a quick little brief history of him, and then uh, we'll get we'll break down his girlfriend. Hey yo, I'm in the hood, 80k house, million dollar net. Shout out 200 rounds, niggas know the rap. Josh has a lot of content that spans a lot of years. I think we're actually entering the ninth or tenth year of the Cobraverse. Usually, with an internet personality like Josh, that's a great thing. It gives you years of crazy stuff to look through. And that does apply to Cobra as much as it does others like him. Even though he hasn't achieved the notoriety that Chris Chan or Jason Genova has, he's still one of the all-time cult classics on the internet. The problem with Cobra is he's a slow build, and it can turn a lot of people away. Because of Josh's raw and unique nature, he's developed a small but dedicated fan base that's been following him since 2012. All right, so there we go. There's a quick little history on King Cobra. I know that's real short, but that clip was by Danknet. He did like a whole one-hour video on him, so if you're interested, check him out. Uh, Danknet on YouTube. He also does other videos about other weird celebrity personalities that are like strange on YouTube. Pretty good. But today we're going to focus on King Cobra's girlfriend and the, dude, this chick is horrifying and uh, it's kind of amazing. So I'm just going to pull up a couple clips and we'll react to them. I also have to add that I am not a hater of King Cobra. I actually, I genuinely like him and I have empathy for him too. I th sometimes I think the trolls go a little too far on him. Uh... But I, I'm I'm genuinely happy that he he's got a girlfriend. You know what I mean? And like, uh, so th no one take this as hate. Like I, I like I genuinely like him. Like I would probably hang out with him in real life. Like I think it'd be interesting. I don't know if I'd go in his apartment because it seems a little messy and stinky. But other than that, I think he's kind of he's he's funny. He's unique. I like people like this. Okay, so we're gonna start this off with a little bit of a banger. Uh, I guess I just I got to give you a little bit more of his personality for you to fully appreciate everything that's going on. But uh, this is like Cobes to the point. And it's like, I, I just love this clip. And I don't know why it makes me giggle every time. I don't give a fuck how big your boyfriend is, honey. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. You can't legally hit me because I'm autistic. I don't go out of my way to cause trouble. But if trouble comes my way, I'll be the last motherfucker you'll ever fuck with. I don't know. Okay, so there, there's Cobra. And that's pretty much him to a T. Hyper delusional. But he's like... <laughs> He's like, your boyfriend get hit. He's like, I'll beat your boyfriend, but you can't hit me because I'm autistic. I love it. It's perfect delusion. This is why, this is what makes him so great. And this is why I know me and him would be best friends if we were like, if we hung out. Okay. So here we are. We're, we're introducing, I think her name's Jessica. I, I, I can't, I don't know. I, I can't be a hundred percent on this, but uh, here, here's Jessica Cobes, new girlfriend. She's turned him into a traumatized Vietnam vet. <laughs> Ignore. No, the I'm just. I can't stop with the. I stop, can't stop stand hitting the, the. Stop hitting the buttons, please. No, I'm not reading. I'm not hitting any buttons, Josh. I'm just scrolling you don't up. Yell, you don't gotta yell at me. If you need me to scroll up, I can Josh, scroll up. How am I yelling at you? You were just yelling at me. <laughs> uh, you can tell there are already a couple. Like I mean, just like the simple bickering. I love it. It's, just, it's so good. No, I was not. <laughs> well, you said, oh, oh my fucking oh my toe. god! <laughs> oh fuck my toe! I didn't mean to. <laughs> well, that just happened. She smells like old Civil War. 
I think Jessica's a lot younger than the Civil War. What the fuck? <laughs> wait, wait to defend your girlfriend, bro. She's a lot of... <laughs> Pick me up. Oh my god, what did he say? I don't even know. I think Jessica's a lot younger than the Civil War. What the fuck? Jessica's a lot younger than the Civil War. <laughs> I would hope so. Silver Joshing. Pick me up. No, I'm not that strong. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Pick me up. I ain't that strong. Oh my god, dude. He's ruthless. I love him. Oh my god. Lose your channel, Josh. Oh my fucking god, oh, dude. The cop was just here because of this crap, and I told him you weren't doing it. Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> Could you please move so I can end the stream? Thank you. Why are we gonna end it? Don't end it, Josh. I want, so, I'll end it if I fucking want to. It's my fucking YouTube channel. I know it's your YouTube channel. If you know that, don't tell me what to do on it, please. Thank you. <laughs> exactly. You're in trouble. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, I don't know. So there's your introduction to Jessica. She's it's pretty funny. As you can tell, she's a. Uh, I don't I don't know what to tell you. Uh, there's like other clips of her. Like I can't tell if she has like a drinking problem or she's like just insane. Some people are saying she's like tweaking on meth. I I don't know. I uh, I'll try to find the clip of her like she's like flailing out to me it looks like she's just drunk and insane maybe she does meth too i i, I don't know anybody's guess but uh <laughs> i don't know they're the way they interact with each other is so funny and i what 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 i think is hella fucked up is i think i really do think she's insane and i think she's like clout hungry or cl clout chasing or whatever and that's why she's with him and as you can tell, she's a little rough around the edges. And uh, so King Cobra is what she gets. You know what I mean? I'm sure she'd be wanting to get somebody else like Aiden Ross or I, I don't know. But, uh, you know, she's got to swing within her. She, you know, she's got to play within her league, you know, and Josh happens to be in her league. So. <laughs> Okay, so this is a uh, this is what I was talking about. Her, like her flailing out. I, I don't know what. Someone in the comments tell me. I I think people would think it's it's tweak, but I swear to God, I remember being at like parties when I was younger, and there was like girls who were like insane, but they'd be like borderline blacked out or whatever. And they'd just be like flailing out or just doing weird shit like that. I I don't I don't know. To me, it just looks like she's drunk and insane, and she got she's fighting demons. You know what I mean? Like she. Like, sad story. She probably is, like, schizophrenic or I, I don't know what she has, bipolar or something. She's not normal. We can guarantee that. She's <laughs> she is not normal at all. But, I don't know. People are saying it's tweak or meth or whatever. I I think she's just drunk and fucking literally insane. And uh, that's why she's, like, flailing out like she's being exorcismed. But, I, I don't know. Let's go into another clip. Okay. I guess this in this clip, There'll be a lot more of, like, her and, like, I guess their, like, interaction. She's, she seems very drunk in this. Like, extremely drunk in this. But, I don't know. You, you make make your own decision. Let me know. I'm beyond comprehension. I'm beyond comprehension. You gotta find <laughs> Smack the ass, you know what I mean? It's rough. God damn. Don't be careful. All right. Oh, fuck your mother. Fuck I see that right there makes me think she's drunk. I like, I don't know. I don't know any other drunk. I mean, I've seen so many drunk people do weird shit like that, and that's what makes me think she's drunk. <clears throat> I don't know. Man. I don't know. I don't have very much experience with drugs, but I, to me, it seems like alcohol. Yeah. Oh, I hate you. <laughs> Drunk. I don't know. That's what it seems like. He is dead inside. Oh my god.
So I don't know why the audio is all fucked up on this clip. They don't need to see that. They don't have to see nothing. I think uh, I think the context of this one, because I saw like another clip. She was like, <clears throat> someone said something about her tits. She like, got all offended and she like tried flashing and he's like live streaming. I, I think he live streams on Facebook. I can't, I can't be 100% sure anymore. It might be YouTube too, but she tried flashing. He like put it down and they like kind of got this like argument about it. So this is like the fallout of it. Oh, that's it. That's the end of it. So that's the end of that clip. Um, that's really all I got. There's like a bunch of other ones, but these are like kind of like the ones I thought were the funniest, I suppose. Um, and kind of like give like a good grasp about this. But best believe I'm following this whole arc. I love it. Uh, I do feel kind of bad for him. There's another, there's like another clip going around. Someone had sent, <laughs> someone sent her. So I'm going to send her a pregnancy test to see if she's pregnant or whatever, which is terrifying. I hope they are not pregnant. I really, really do hope they're not pregnant because that is fucked for the kid. Um, but there's still more stuff unfolding. If you guys like this and want me to like do an update about it later on, let me know. Uh, like Write a comment or like give a like or something like that. Um, other than that, that's really all I got. All right. Well, thanks. And hopefully you guys thought this was, uh, just as enjoyable and entertaining as I did. Anyways, you guys have a good day.